Make sure you check out my recipe book, Real Food at Real Simple, your plant-based lifestyle guide for life's daily quest for the best. So if you're looking to lose weight or if you're you know, looking to clear your skin, this is an absolutely awesome beginner's introductory guide to living a plant-based lifestyle. Uh, check it out following the first link in the description box below. Gotta get fucking lean like Derek. Gotta get lean as Derek. Gotta get fucking lean. Gotta work out. Ooh, good morning, good morning. So what do we have for breakfast? Boom. Same thing. Mm. So I'm not working today. It's probably close to minus 20 Celsius with the wind chill out. So I'm not going to be leaving the house today. I'm going to be just be staying inside. Um, so what I'm going to do today is I'm going to tag this video what I ate today to feel um, to feel really good or something like that. Something along those lines. So that's what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to focus on feeling good. How do I focus on feeling good? Through mental loops, through repeating affirmations to myself. So I love myself, I love myself. Repeating uh, good words. So if I think to myself, if I love myself truly and deeply, how would I feel? I'd feel love, I'd feel excitement, enthusiasm, like passion, damn, feeling good. That's how I kind of focus on feeling good because nothing externally to me has to change. No conditions in my world have to change in order for me to feel good. Consequently, when you start to feel better, um, just for no reason at all, you start to bring more things into your life that make you feel good. And so if you've checked out my, um, my new channel, I Love Myself, 365 Day Experiment in Self-Love, that's kind of like the premise for the channel is to feel good without the conditions in your world changing. And I just posted a 30-day self-love experiment update video um, just talking about what I've experienced throughout the first 30 days of this. So fantastic video and fantastic channel as well because obviously I'm in it. Something else that I like to do is I like to read really good books. Really good books. So this book here, it doesn't have the cover on it. Uh, my friend, well not my friend, my girlfriend sent it to me. Hi, Carb Hannah. And it's... Uh, it's called The Power by Rhonda Burns. So she's the one that created The Secret. Just fuck it. Phenomenal book. Phenomenal book. Just puts you, just keeps refreshing in your mind that you want to be feeling good, feeling love, feeling joy, excitement, passion, clarity, excitement, feeling good. Another book that I love to read, Feeling is the Secret. So this is a, a really short book by Neville Goddard. It will take you 30 minutes to read. Just keeps reintroducing these really good thoughts into your head that feeling good is so important. And then another good book, Love Yourself Like Your Life Depends On It. So it's these these three books plus this one here, The Power of Awareness, are the only four books that I'm going to be reading in 2015. <laughs> so I was, <laughs> I keep burping in my videos. Um, so there was one other book that I was going to read, uh, Live Your Truth, also by uh, Kamal Ravikant. Um, but I exchanged it out for the power because um, Hannah was like, you got to read this book. And I was like, all right, I'll check it out. And so I read it and I'm like, okay, I just got to focus on this book as well. This is good. So that's what I'm doing today. Just focus on feeling good. So I've, um, I've used um, an app on my, on my laptop called Self Control to block my internet. So I can't go and check email or anything like that. And then on my phone... Even though I don't have cell phone reception, I like I use uh, I just use Wi-Fi for my for my iPhone, and I've just put it on airplane mode so that I'm not going to get any pings, I'm not going to get any messages or anything like that. Um, so I can just totally focus without any distractions, just on reading, just on feeling good, and I'm not going to be distracted because I am so easily distracted. So I like to go check my email, I like to go check Instagram, I like to go check this, I like to go check that, right? Constantly, so if I'm kind of feeling bored or whatever, um, I need to go, you know, check these things constantly. See if I have new emails, see if I have any new comments, see how my latest video is doing, right? Like, so I like to just uh, focus on removing those distractions and bringing that really good energy in by reading good books, by doing positive affirmations. That's what I'm doing so far today. Got the smoothie. I'm gonna make another potato stew today to use up the rest of the ingredients that I bought two days ago or three days ago, I think. And uh, yeah, I'll catch up with you guys later on. So it's a lazy day today. So what are we having for lunch here? So 
at about 11 o'clock, I started making potato stew. So what's in here? Um, a bunch of potato, a bunch of sweet potato, um, a cup of red lentils, um, one quart of veggie stock, um, some curry powder, um, some carrots, and then I just added in some broccoli later on. It still kind of looks like it got destroyed, um, but that's all right. So all I'm doing with this is taking it and just going Whoa, onto a bit of rice. Just bam. Throw a little bit more on there. So again, not counting calories, just eating as much as I care for. No minimum calories for the day. So this is all high carb, super low fat and super deliciousness right there. Um, baby, check that stuff out. Check it out. So good. One more bowl of the rice and potato stew on top. I also put on some black pepper and I drizzled in some rice vinegar as well. Boom, baby, nice. Okay, so that's what I've had to eat today to feel amazing. So on certain days, I just like to chill and just focus on reading really good books, um, chatting with my friends, like just having an easy day. I love easy days like this, but I also like busy days as well. Busy days are nice, but I also like to have chill days where I'm just kind of focusing on myself um, and just kind of nurturing my own needs for just relaxing and you know I, I, I had like a nice nap today as well so just like just relaxing and just feeling good um, so I think feeling good feeling good in your body definitely diet plays a role but it's not the only determining factor so focusing on really good thoughts um, becoming a positive information consumption junkie which is a funny term that I like to use so reading really good books um, on a daily basis, if you can read a good book for 20 to 30 minutes every day, that's better than reading it for zero minutes. Um, you know, focusing on good, strong mental loops. So, you know, you can tell yourself that you love yourself or that you accept yourself or you can say, I am love. Like, just revel in good feelings and ramp it up. R repeat it over and over and over again. Over and over and over again. Repetition is so important day in, day out. That's why it's like, just having this focus commitment for either like 30 days or 60 days or 90 days because that's where you're going to see measurable measurable change in your life things are going to start happening in your life because when you're putting out a different vibration you're going to basically the world is going to reflect that vibration that you're putting out so if you're putting out more loving good vibes you're going to get those loving good vibes back in your life um, it's something that i've noticed just since i started doing my self-love experiment uh, 33 days ago and I've noticed that a lot of things that I wanted in my life have actually started to kind of uh, manifest in some beautiful ways. Awesome. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Hope you are enjoying these video vlogs. If you have any more questions or comments, um, leave them in the box below. I do have a uh, kind of a list of them going, so I'll probably answer those maybe tomorrow. Awesome. Peace out, guys.